Eric, this guy claims he's the guy who asked for the IQ results for our staff. Yeah, and this guy's IQ is what? Because he can't tell a bit from a fucking reality. You were hey. doing a bit? Hey, say you little second midget. I'm still waiting for uh, Frodo to call us and say it was a bit. Read his book when it comes out later this year. It, and why are you using, hey, why are you using Howard Stern's name to get laid at the Bunny Ranch and then they cop you and everything, they treat you like gold, and then you treat the owner like shit when he comes to visit you. Why is that? And then you're, you're calling Howard and saying, hey, get me back in the Bunny Ranch. For starters, it's not the owner. Check your facts. Dennis Hoff owns the Bunny Ranch, not Rich. Yes. Okay, and when, and when is your high school reunion? <laughs> it's the 15th, but I'm not going to it. Yeah, and didn't you win uh, three quarters of a million dollars on uh, online and playing poker or something? No, I guess I was a bit too, huh? God, you're an idiot. Yeah, well, you're Vince, a fucking fag. Anyway, Vince, it's unbelievable. So, yeah. you, so yes, what did you want to say about the IQ results? Okay, well, here's here's my list, okay? I got Fred at number one. No, yeah, Fred's right. not even taking it. I know, that's too bad because right. I think he'd beat everybody. So do I. And I, I have Robin at a close second, right. very close second. I've got you as three, and then I've got Tracy and Lisa G. All right. Hey, Vince, i got to run anyway. We're going to find out the results in a couple of, you know. <laughs> All right. Uh, hey, Eric, did you want to ask anything? I was hoping to get on when Hogan comes in. I, I don't what mind. do you want to say? You yeah, know because I don't mind putting you on when Hogan comes in, but, you know, sometimes you come on. Come you on say and nothing. Yeah, you drone on. He'll ask if, you wanna, if you want to put your audience to sleep, Howard, just, keep, just put them on. What do you want to ask? I wanted to ask about if um, they're going to have any new uh, TNA knockout. What? <laughs> I don't even understand what you just said. <laughs> if TNA is going to add any more females to their knockout division. Uh, no, but just for you, they're going to add some hot guys. You know what, motherfucker? That may be your fantasy that I'm gay, but FYI, I'm not. Hey, you want to go to New York? Why don't you roll your wheelchair or strap some balloons there and fly there yourself? You fucking faggot. Eric, the gay weapon. Hey, you know what I want to do? I want I want to invent a wheelchair with a remote control. I'll have the remote control. I'll put you on the side of the freeway, and I'll start playing Frogger using you in the wheelchair. You know and what, Eric? To... Well, Vince, Vince, never mind that. Eric, the problem with putting you on with Hulk Hogan is that, like, we kind of don't... When we talk to Hulk Hogan, we barely talk about wrestling. Yeah. It's more about, like, the guy's life as opposed to the whole wrestling. Like, most of us don't care if there's going to be more women. I don't even think Hulk would know if more women are going to be added to TNA. He's part of the uh, TNA head office that hires the people that. No, that's come just for. He's buying that's, into the whole storyline. That's a storyline they developed for him. Hulk Hogan doesn't have anything to do with that. He's an employee. He doesn't. He doesn't work in the front office. He's out banging that new fucking chick of his. He's busy with her titties. Him and Bischoff and Hervey are producing the <laughs> show. You know what? I am I going to keep that. you on the line so I can prove to you that I'm right once and for all. It's a, it's it's. Hulk Hogan is Hulk Hogan on too. Him, myself, and Matt Rendezzo were talking about it the other night. Who? <laughs> Who is he talking about? I don't now? know. Eric's Eric's the worst. You're not good when you're on with celebrities. You slow everything down. Vince is right. Hey, Art, can, I, can you keep me on hold through the Hogan interview? All right, hold on, hold on. I'll put you on hold. I'm going to put both of you guys on hold. Hmm. Here, Eric, I'll put you back on hold first. And I'm going to let you ask that question. You know what? Why am I getting sucked into this? It's only going to fuck the interview up. It'll be terrible. Eric, it's going to be terrible. Do you have any other question you can ask that's sort of more interesting? Like, you know what I mean? Not really. Yeah. I could ask you one now. Do you watch 
uh, the deadliest warrior on Spike TV. What? <laughs> Do you watch the deadliest warrior on Spike TV? No. Be sure to watch it this Tuesday. Tony's on it. Okay. All right. All right, Eric. Thanks. I'll talk, uh, all right, I'm just putting him on hold. I don't know what he wants from me. He wants to talk to Hulk and yeah. slow down an interview. Yeah, we should just say, here's Eric to slow down the interview if it's going really well. All right, Vince, hold on, okay? Everything, all right. All right. Everybody, I don't even see Eric anymore. I might have hung up on him. Oh, he'll call back. No. It's already 9.30. Well, but, yeah, we're no. finished the interview. Oh, we're done, he can't yeah. ruin he it. He can't right? ruin it now, right? <laughs> yeah, okay. All right, right, Eric, go ahead real quick. No. Hi, Hogan, how are you? Good, Eric Mania, what up, brother? I'm good. And uh, I just wanted to ask if you guys were considering adding any more knockouts to the list of knockouts, because I know, too, that... Hulk's asleep. I've been online. <laughs> he fell asleep. Well, let me tell you something, Eric, the maniac. <laughs> yeah. The TNA knockout girls on a consistent basis usually have the oh. highest numbers. Even on the crossover segments and the top of the hours, they kill it. And we're right. definitely at, we're, it, it's a good decision to add more women. And so will you be doing it? I'd love to. You would love to, but it's not up to it's you. It's all about, no, it is. Right. But it isn't. And, it, you know, it depends on. Where we're at budget wise and stuff. And I see. And Hiring pushing, people costs money, and no, so. we're, we're pushing hard now. We got a good crew, but we'd love mm -hmm. to have more right. girls and ratings and the whole deal. Two that I told Jeremy. Uh -oh. About oh, he's got suggestions. No, it can't be a follow up, can there? To this, a April Hunter and Lizzie Valentine. Who are they? Porn stars. They're, they're they're both no, they're both involved in wrestling. Liz, Lizzie appeared in WWE for a little while. And April is with one of the... All right, Eric, i got to get out of this. I don't care. All right, thank you. Thank you, Eric. Thanks, Eric. I thought uh, it was Eric, only one... The Black Panther. I thought there was a, a one Eric question. I didn't realize we were going to be seven. You didn't know you'd be going down this whole line right. of questions.